Hi, welcome to Once Upon a Game. My name is Kevin Kitchens, and in this episode we're going to unbox, or rather unbag, Battle Pack number four. This is for Combat Commander Pacific. It's the New Guinea uh, campaign, and this is from GMT Games. Um, been out of print for a while, and like all the Combat Commander series, just recently got a reprint of everything, and so finally uh, this expansion to Combat Commander Pacific is now readily available so comes in a folder with a large ziploc bag which is how it's going to get to you and then you're probably going to end up putting it with your the rest of your combat commander pacific stuff so let's just see what you get real quick 14 scenarios six new battle maps you'll open it up so like i said it's a uh, folder and in the folder are the scenarios. You got M1 through M11, because the scenarios in the base game were A through L. So we're starting with M. Let's slide around. And they are mostly double-sided. Let's see, there's 14, so seven cards. Uh, and these are great, having them in the card format. It would be nice if the base game did likewise, or they would release the base game scenarios in this card stock format but until they do uh, we are stuck with a book for those and this just wants to dance all over the place doesn't it so you get your orders of battle for the event a little bit of the situation report uh, and then how you set it up and any special rules like the first scenario is a night mission so the night rules are in effect so on and so forth so um, Gloomy Forest, Rab Rabul, Rousers, Rebooked at Rabbi, Templeton's Crossing, so on and so forth. Usually some really funny in jokes here on some of the names. So you've got Japanese versus Australia, Anzac Forces, and Japanese versus US Forces. So you get that, and you're going to get for the 14 scenarios, you're going to get um, six, or excuse me, three maps. Which gives you six maps to three map sheets, which gives you six total maps. So, just like the others, I mean, the good thing about Comic Commander is the maps are all a standard size in terms of uh, hex count because the cards have on them the random hexes, and so they know exactly. And it's always played in this tight battle. That's one of the beauties of it is it's so close in that it just deals with infantry. Uh, you don't have to worry about any of the armor or any of that stuff. You just get to focus on the infantry and having these standardized. So you're going to get three of these um, maps, double-sided, M1, M2, and the scenarios will tell you which ones to use, uh, obviously. So uh, you got six different maps, 14 scenarios, which means you're going to reuse some of these a lot. So there's um, a lot of new content that comes in this expansion. And then, like I said, these will just go into the box, and the however you store your game will uh, it'll probably not stay in this folder. But anyway, three maps going into their respective sides here. Uh, 14 scenario cards, or seven scenario cards, double-sided, 14 missions, and a folder, a plastic bag. And that is what you're going to get in Battle Pack. Number four, New Guinea for Combat Commander Pacific. Combat Commander Pacific. Thanks so much for watching. God bless you. Have a great day. Bye bye. Oh.